Hello folks, and welcome to another episode of Smooth Magic. We're going to be taking a look at another of the VIP packs here. As we uh, continue the hunt for a couple of uh, cards we have yet to see. Uh, we have yet to see things like a doubling season, a Jace, a Karn. Still a bunch of stuff out there that we can uh, get. So let's go ahead and get cracking here. Hope you're all having a fantastic day. And that uh, you know, you've come here hoping to relax, decompress, and watch some uh, magic product being opened. These VIP packs have really been a lot of fun to open up with you all. And I am continuously excited to see what we can pull here. Alright, here we go. We'll start running with the commons. Throw those off to the side. There we go. Alright, uncommons. Nice fatal push. A little bit of a gladiator theme there. No, not Gladiator, that was 300. Yeah, this is Sparta. I love, every time I see that, I love see, seeing the, <laughs> the Russian knowledge. All right, here we go. Let's see, how do we want to set this up? Oh yeah, that's right, we have them side by side here. So first one was the Endless Atlas, and then Ascends Triplets. Oh, this is great, I remember this right here. This was a, a big thing in, uh, was it the Mystery Boosters that had that? Uh, big card, big card. First uh, showcase foil, we got the Brainstorm. Oh, absolutely gorgeous. Avacyn, Angel of Hope. Her armor is very, very shiny there. A very great first pull to start off the openings. Alright, number two. And again, we're looking for about three mythics here, three of the mythic showcases. So that's a pretty strong box. Uh, you know, anywhere between two and three is right in line there with uh, what we're looking for. But yeah, a very, very strong pack. The uh, Avacyn Angel of Hope almost pays for the entire uh, entire box, I believe. Okay, another overflowing chalice. A culling dice, a vampire hex mage, good old reclamation sage. Ooh, that is, uh, I don't, oh, the mark right, yes, we've seen this card before. Just kind of took me off guard. Almost looks like a um, Shadows over Innistrad art type thing. All right, first one, first rare we got is the Time Sieve, followed by a Maelstrom Pulse. Okay. Yeah, of course. <laughs> the crop rotation, you gotta have them. And a Chrome Mox. All right, that is a great pull. So that's our second Mythic there in two boxes. Quite a good trend here. Let's see if we can continue that with a box number three. I don't know that we've yet hit a inner case here that's got all Mythics. So four Mythics in the showcase slot. I think our best is three. Of course, the force of will is. Well, what is that? I don't. That, that looks weird. That does not look right. Like there's something on there. I don't believe that's part of the artwork. Maybe it is. I'll have to keep my eye out, but that just looks. Is it actually on the. printed on? Yeah, okay, I guess that is. It's. It just kind of stands out there with the foil, but I think that's the back leg. Uh, weird. I'll set this one aside and actually look at that one later. <laughs> All right. And the gelatinous Genesis. Let's 
Sir Sarah Sphinx, the O Najinta. Probably butchered the pronunciation of that one. All right, first rare, we got the uh, B Baleful Strix here. And we got a Vengevine for our, another mythic here, regular mythic. The Lightning Greaves. And a Sword of Light and Shadow. That is mythic number three. I love the artworks on these, these swords of the set. They just really knocked it out of the park. So that is three mythics, three boxes. Can we continue the trend here? It'd be nice to pull in a big a heavy hitter just to finish out. You know, these have all been pretty heavy hitter mythics, but ending with like a Force of Will or a Jace would just really take the cake. Okay, folks, last pack. Thank you so much for tuning in today and checking us out here on Smooth Magic. We hope that you return and join us for some future pack openings, whether that be Double Masters. You know, of course, we got some Core 2021 that we finished up. Um, and of course, the uh, Zendikar Rising, which is the next hotness coming. That should be a lot of fun. A lot of fun. Uh, I believe there's going to be some fetch lions there, so we'll be on the hunt for those. All right, first uh, rare here is the Graven Cairns. Council's Judgment. An exploration, a very nice heavy hitter here, and an expedition map. Okay. Well, there we have it, folks. Thank you all for joining once again. And as always, we're wishing you all to have a smooth day. <laughs>